Hey everyone, Alex Terrace here. So I am doing a video on one of the portable saunas that is a lay down. And if you don't know anything about me, you can find a lot of my videos online. I am a dealer for many brands of infrared saunas, um, all brands of infrared gemstone mats, uh, as well as uh, high, high powered infrared lasers and a variety of other photobiomodulation equipment. Uh, so if you are looking for very unbiased consultative information, then this video and others uh, will be the ones to review and you can reach out to me anytime. So first off, important thing to know is there are several brands of infrared dome style portable saunas. And the first thing I would like to inform you about is that the lay down is the best way to get the maximum amount of infrared exposure on the body because you are surrounded 360 degrees with infrared emitters or infrared rays. Okay. And the other piece too, is that if you think about sitting upright in a sauna, uh, when you are seated, depending on the type of seat, uh, your uh, backside of the legs um, and or sometimes calves would be on a bench, right? Or on a chair and not be getting necessarily infrared exposure. So if you're laying down one of these guys here uh, as one example of a brand, which we'll be going over here in a second, uh, when you lay down, of course, the whole backside of your legs, the whole top side of your legs, really again, all around, you get infrared exposure. Getting the legs exposed fully is very effective uh, in general because you have about 70% of your microcirculatory vessels in your legs. Uh, so in other words, you have a lot of blood going to your legs. And so shining infrared rays into that blood and those vessels of the legs, well, then of course, circulating that blood to your upper body because you are laying down, you have less gravity, you are able to actually get more of that warmed, charged up, hemoglobin blood into your upper body, which provides your upper body and organs also more benefits, as well as it's the most efficient way to raise your core body temperature um, because the 360 degrees infrared. Um, now let's dive into this particular brand here. Um, and so this is the few different ones that they do. Um, they are and I'm gonna basically go over in this video, just to be clear, I'm not gonna mention other brands of domes, but I am going to specifically mention features that this brand has that others do not, okay? That way that's the most efficient use of your time. So, you, and when you see some of these benefits, you may agree that actually they are legitimately therapeutic features that uh, you know, might make this particular option better than most. Um, and I would also, again, let you know that there's a couple ways to get a discount on this brand by contacting me. Uh, so they have three different ones uh, right off the bat, just so you realize uh, what is unique is that they also make one wider and taller. See this one, the Luxor Zero XL. So one common uh, critique amongst other domes is that uh, if you're a person that is just a larger individual, broader shoulders, larger belly, I mean, whatever it is, taller, uh, you know, some of the more standard size domes out there can be a little bit of a tight squeeze. Uh, and yeah, so this was very intelligent for them to basically give you at least another option of something taller and wider. Uh, and for, again, for a very reasonable price, this is still actually at this price point for the larger construction actually still significantly comes below uh, some of the other options out there. So very, very competitively priced. Just so you know, right off the bat, uh, this actually is the most competitively priced of all domes, all brands in the industry. I would also add that many, many brands have gone through a 100, uh, <clears throat> sorry, 500 to $2,000 price increase on just infrared saunas in general because of the supply chain issues over the last two, week, two years. Uh, this company has not raised their prices. They actually have a very good supplier. So there is no back stock issues, back order issues. Uh, and there is also no price increase, which is extremely unusual right now in the infrared sauna industry. Believe me, I know it's very frustrating. I deal with 
a lot of other back order issues with different companies at the moment anyways so they make different size here that's unusual the other unusual thing for this dome uh, that nobody else does is that they actually are putting tourmaline discs you can see them there right and you can see them on the underside as well they have tourmaline uh, discs and uh, also germanium and uh, and then the mats also have some additional have jade and beyond anyways uh the i'm pointing that out because all the other domes out there just purely use a carbon uh, carbon emitters for producing the infrared uh, inside of the dome structure and uh, inside the mat as well. Uh, now this brand of course does have that as well, um, but in addition, they also add these minerals, okay? Now these minerals have been studied for many, many, many decades um, and specifically more over in Asia and China and Japan uh, in terms of all the infrared benefits they provide. And also the fact that when you heat up certain sorts of stones, they produce negative ions. And you can just do a quick Google. There's so many studies out there now going on 50, 60, 70 years on negative ions and the benefits. Uh, there's even some studies that show that if you produce negative ions um, inside of a uh, sort of like heating therapy, it will actually help the body to raise its core body temperature. And that has to do with increasing certain sorts of cellular metabolism processes. Okay, so which are basically, you could just say synergistic with some of the benefits that are provided by um, infrared sauna or sauna therapy or hyperthermia therapy as they call it. So, so yes, this is unusual having a dome um, with some of these minerals on top. And uh, I would also say too that their EMF, you can see they break it down into EMF. So. Uh, when you see MG, that stands for milligauss. Okay, so that's, that's more like the magnetic flux. And then ELF, electrical force, that's more the electrical portion. Okay, so normally when you have a something that's electronic running a current through a wire, you have a magnetic field that's produced. And uh, transversely to that, you also have an electrical force as well. Okay, a field that's given off. So one thing you'll see for a couple dome brands is they do not provide you the ELF measurement, the electrical force, just so you know. Uh, you can try to request it. Um, a couple of brands will not give you that measurement, although there are some individuals out there who have done their own review with meters, electrical meters, and have shown the levels on different brands. It's easy to find. Anyways, um, now this company does give you upfront the testing on both of them, and it is technically the lowest in both categories, okay? Now, there are a few other domes out there and some other portables that use carbons that uh, have a milligauss range right here that is quite similar and certainly low enough. Um, the area that we that some brands need to improve, however, is the electrical field, okay? That is something that you know, you'll see a big discrepancy on just in general uh, amongst all sauna brands. Um, most, a lot of sauna types of products, uh, infrared in general, they don't pay attention to this, the companies, and they don't usually give you ratings. That's just generally true. But you can find people doing reviews, including myself with different meters. So anyways, just wanted to point out on the ELF side, uh, it is the lowest as well in the industry. So that's really, really quite nice. Uh, because uh, a couple of the brands out there can actually be quite high. And what that does, just FYI, folks, is that raises what's called your body voltage. Uh, although it's not the type of body voltage that's beneficial. Okay, so that's, I know it's a little confusing, um, but uh, you, can, you can look into that a little bit further. And also, if you want to look up the search terms, like the benefits of grounding. So when you have like excessive EMF around you, um, there's some things you can do to stay grounded around your computer and other electronics. Uh, so when you're getting blasted by ELF, um, it, the less you're getting blasted by, um, you know, you will not have such a great necessity to ground out that energy. Okay, so it won't disrupt your nervous system and that type of thing. So this is a great thing to do uh, as well, get the lowest level. So again, that is also very unusual, okay? Um, the last thing I was just going to say about uh, the premium here, so just if you wanted a quick comparison between the Luxor Zero and the Premium Zero, um, 
they decided to go with uh, a lot more germanium in terms of the mineral, okay? Now, when you get into that mineral, they actually use germanium in semiconductors. I just picked, picked this particular page here. Although, uh, you know, this information right here as the supplement of germanium, actually when you are sending waves, electromagnetic waves, which includes infrared, through a mineral like germanium, germanium stone, you actually can get a lot of the same benefits as supplementing with the mineral germanium or having a plant or an herb that is high in germanium, okay? You can, you're welcome to just pop over on this website here at the top, it's good. Uh, I, I am a big fan of angstrom minerals, by the way. Um, they can be very advantageous. There is another brand I like more though. Um, so if you want some information on that or a discount, uh, just let me know. But basically, uh, it does give you a lot of different benefits to your immune system, to oxygen transport and other cellular benefits. So again, when you send infrared, okay, like a heat wave wavelength, which is infrared is a light wave, and you transmit that through a mineral or an element, uh, if it's in like a stone, for example, you actually get the same frequency, okay, transmit it into the body. So remember, when you take a supplement or you take like a mineral, what that's doing is that's allowing that frequency, okay, the transmission of the wave inside the body to influence different cellular functions. You don't necessarily have to take that supplement, have to consume the element. You can also just get the frequency multiple ways. One of those ways is you can have a light wave like infrared. It's an invisible wavelength transmit that frequency. So you can go read about the benefits of germanium. I absolutely have tracked people getting much better results with germanium. They're not the first company to do, to do this. It was actually Biomat and Biomat used a germanium topper and they also have a pad that you can sit on. I do sell Biomat, I sell many infrared gemstone mats, but I just wanted to point out that uh, I think that is the only other company that's using germanium. This particular form of germanium is the one that has the greatest uh, benefits, long story short, okay? So let's get now a little bit more into the details of a few other things that makes this dome unique. So we'll just click on this real quick here. Here we go. So we talked about the super low ELF and EMF, which is unusual. We talked about the um, gemstones on top of the carbon emitters, which is unusual, okay? And uh, the other thing that we want to take a look at here uh, is, that makes it unique, is right here. Do you see this right here? Environmentally friendly, solvent-free, PU vegan leather, heat resistance, high durability. So again, you want a material that is designed ideally to handle uh, heat, like high heat. Believe it or not, in the sauna industry in general, so I'm talking about wood cabin saunas, we're talking about portables, uh, there's actually a lot of brands that have certain things in saunas equipment that are not really designed over time to deal with um, high heat or heat temperature changes that go high and low. And what that does is if the material is not designed that way and it has some sorts of solvents in it, you see this word here? <laughs> So what can happen is certain chemical solvents with the high heat going up and down and up and down. Um, so I've found some equipment out there, the molecular bonds will break down with the heat infrared. And that can release VOCs, volatile organic compounds and other toxins into the air, into the room that you're in, especially over time. So one thing is you want to ideally ensure the materials in a sauna, especially portables, because portables can be kind of sketchy uh, you want to make sure the material that's used for this thing is solvent free, okay? High heat resistance and check this out, compatible with ozone therapy, all right? This is very unusual, very, very unusual. There's only one other brand on the market sold by an ozone company that actually has a dome or just basically has a type of sauna that can handle ozone. Ozone is three oxygen atoms. If you've never heard of it, Google, Google about ozone and the benefits, but basically ozone is highly oxidative. So basically what that means is whatever it touches, it can basically cause a lot of damage to it, okay? Um, it's not harmful for the body, just FYI. 
um, if you are inhaling it, um, it is harmful. But I just wanted to point out that a material that can handle ozone, which is highly oxidative or corrosive, that means that that material is above and beyond resilient to breakdown. Okay. So this is very, very, very unusual that a sauna is, uh, that the materials used again are okay with ozone. Okay. So there's probably like zero chance really that this material over time is going to off gas in any kind of way if it can handle ozone also. So it's a really good material that they're using. Um, I will say that uh, popping inside of here and getting an ozone generator to produce ozone in there, which absorbs transdermally through the pores of your body is a good modality to do. Goes into your bloodstream and gives you benefits. If you need a discount or suggestion on what ozone generator to go with, um, to put inside of this dome, I can let you know um, what I would recommend on that. So again, that's highly unusual. This is great materials that they're using, okay? Very, very durable. And yeah, so that's probably the last point that I wanted to end on um, was the materials, okay? That's another big, big thing where you can tell the difference in quality between portables. The last thing I would say is you see this right here, this little mat, this infrared mat, this infrared gemstone mat with the jade on top, the jade and the, and the bion or bion. Uh, this also does, on top of having stones or elements, it does have carbon emitters and other layers inside of it. It also has a layer to uh, block the electro smog and filter it, of course. The reason that that's unusual for lay down portables is that the other lay down portables do not uh, basically just have a mat beneath the person that is not as strong. It just doesn't produce as much infrared. Some don't have any mat. They just have a reflective infrared material. Some have a type of infrared mat that has like a memory film or, or a layer on top of it, which blocks some of the infrared rays from shining through. So it's not quite as intense. Uh, and it's just kind of more about comfort and keeping keeping your body temperature more warm. This one, the mat is uh, almost like a standalone infrared mat, so you could use this as a standalone. In other words, it's uh, it's 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 strong. So there's standalone infrared gemstone mats that you can buy out there, okay? And they produce a lot of infrared rays. So this is like one of those mats that's included with the whole system, okay? So that is unusual. So you're getting a lot of infrared from your backside too. This will more efficiently help you raise your core body temperature and get the maximum amount of infrared in here. Also the, the, the dome temperature that this gets to inside is, is actually the hottest in the industry as well. Um, I believe it's 194 is what we can track in there. Where are we? I'm just scrolling down here to temperature here. Uh, look at that dome temperature. So sometimes it's nice to actually do nice, really relaxing, take a nap, do some really cool temperatures and just get some passive infrared. I always recommend that to, to um, help with your parasympathetic nervous system and function. Sometimes you just wanna blast yourself in outer space and it's really, really good to do super hot. And, and that also stimulates heat shock proteins and stuff. So this dome also gets about the hottest of any infrared sauna that I know of basically, um, both portables and traditional cabins. 194 is uh, like crazy hot <laughs> for infrared. Um, part of the reason is because the mat also is, uh, is really intense. And again, all this can be adjusted. So don't worry about it. If, if you don't deal with hot temperatures, um, you know, the nice thing is when you get a portable, it's very highly adjustable and it warms up extremely efficiently. So technically this one does warm up the most efficiently uh, of any of the domes and just because of the obvious intensity and a lot of it does have to do with the mat here too, okay? And the materials that are being used. Uh, the other nice thing that we like to see uh, with portables that is unusual and uh, also um, unusual with other saunas is just a lot of different certifications right here. So on portables, it's uh, unusual um, to see that many certifications. That's third party, right? 
you know, so, you know, even if you don't know if you like the company or trust them, you usually, of course, can trust third party certifications. And you can obviously always go look up those com the company on those third party uh, organizations on their websites, uh, just to, to increase the trust factor. Uh, this company also ships out the saunas as fast. I mean, it, just about as fast as possible, um, usually within like the next day. Uh, so they're shipping like within a week, which is crazy. I mean, potentially even arriving to the person. Um, most portables are taking about two weeks. Traditional saunas are weeks, months, months at this point. It's more like months. So if you are looking to get in general like a sauna, infrared sauna faster, I would generally go for more like a portable. Um, and this one is like lightning fast in terms of shipping. Uh, so anyways, uh, you can click on my link uh, that you'll see here, the little hyperlink, which you can just order right off the website. And, uh, you know, it's pretty straightforward. Um, if you wanted a special discount, an additional discount off the price, uh, what we would do is we would handle that directly. And I would actually, once I have your email, I would send you an invoice. Okay. And basically I would just take your order that way. Um, and submit that order to the company. That allows me to actually provide a uh, additional discount off of these prices that you're seeing here. So uh, we could do as much as 50 to 100 bucks. Um, so yeah, it's up to you or if you just wanna keep it simple. If you have questions, you see the live chat function uh, right here on the page. You can ask me questions about this brand. You can ask me a question about the other brands that you see on the website. Uh, and you can ask me about literally all kinds of other infrared equipment out there. I deal with it all. I deal with a lot of different companies. Uh, so again, be happy to answer your questions anytime. If I'm not available to talk to you, just leave me a message and I get back to you always within 24 hours. Thanks for watching. Appreciate you.